say it's heavy. And it's crisp. I'm going to start speaking Italian here pretty soon. My name is Steven Bardo, former Flying Illini and NBA point guard turned basketball analyst. I have traveled the world through basketball, and the one thing I have found is everyone loves food and sports. What's up, y'all? It's your man, Stephen Barter, coming at you with another edition of America Loves Food and Sports. Back in 1994, Fabriano, Italy, Team Systems is where I was playing professional basketball. So I know a thing or two about authentic Italian cuisine. We're here in Lakewood, Ohio at Molto Bene. And y'all know me, I hear a lot of hype, but I need to check it out. So let's go in. Molto Bene with the owner, Gonzalo Igosque. What part of Italy is the chef from? Uh, Luca, it's Tuscany. Tuscany, okay. What is Tuscany known for? What kind of food are they best known for? Mostly what they do is a beautiful sauce like Lucchese. Mm. Uh, many seafood on the food too. Classic Italian like frutto di mare, like uh, gamberis or grapes, dishes. Mostly at this way, lasagna because it's an Italian classic. Too. Sure. The, the original name in Italian is cachuco and also the linguine with salmon, and Atlantic salmon. And Liliana is also owner with her husband Gonzalo. And uh, Liliana, share with us what we're about to try here. So, really good thing is linguine uh, pasta al dente mm -hmm. uh, with Atlantic salmon and pistachio. So, we won't, we won't say yeah. the secret, no, right? No, no, Keep no. The this place is really good. Okay. It's the best. You can try I'm about to get down on this. Liliana said this is one of the best dishes. And everything that we've seen in here so far uh, has been authentic Italian food. So, let's take a share. And it's fresh. I'm going to start speaking Italian here pretty soon. This takes me back to Italy. Very fresh. As Liliana said, the special sauce, we can't reveal that, but it really gives it a, a fresh flavor. The salmon is excellent, the, the pasta is great, and the sauce is really good. This is Russ Foster, and Russ has been here every week that they have opened. Why do you come here so often? Well, not only is the food, and it's the guy, it's the people, it's the quality of people that, that make this place different and will make it survive in, in the future. Okay, what dishes do you like to eat when you come? Japino. Japino. It's oh, the okay. seafood stew. It's an ounce egg. Let me show you where I play. Where is Fabriano? Right there. This is where I play in Fabriano. This dish right here that we're going to have, Brutto de Mare, we used to eat all the time. We go from Fabriano to Rimini, Ancona. And this is the Adriatic Sea, so all this area got really good fresh seafood. And what's your name? Glorien. Glorien? Steven, nice to nice meet, you. meet you. Thank you for helping us out. Okay. Can you tell us what this is? Uh, risotto al frutto di mare. Risotto frutto di mare, yes. okay. So it has mussels, shrimps, calamari, clams, and it's over risotto okay. with our homemade pomodoro sauce. The rice is excellent. And traditional risotto. And I love the sauce. Oh yeah. This is the real deal. I'm used to the seafood over pasta, but the seafood over risotto is just as good. This is Chopino. This is Chopino. Chopino. This is Vincenzo. Vincenzo is the lead chef here. And so explain to us what's in this. It's all seafood. Okay. Fish, muscoli, bombole, the, the green bombole, mm. gamberi or shrimp. Where are you from in Italy? Toscany. Tuscany. Luca. Luca. So Tuscany is good for wine, right? Good for wine, good for food, good for everything. Good for everything. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Appreciate it. The stew is excellent. It's got a little bit of a kick to it, the spice, but it's not overpowering. It's wonderful bread. You have to take it and dip it into the stew to get the really good flavor. 
Oh man, I'm back in Papiano, y'all. Right here we have spumoni, which is a traditional dessert from South Italy. This is ice cream, whipped cream on top. There's chocolate, vanilla, and strawberry on here. Mm, mm, mm. All right, and let's taste this. So this is chocolate here with a little bit of um, gelato on the side. Oh man, look at that. Can you see that? How that, how that kind of oozes out? Almost like fudge. <laughs> this is to die for, seriously. I tell you what, man, that made me feel like I was back in Fabriano. That's original Italian cuisine at its finest. Gonzalo and Liliana are great hosts and owners of this really cozy establishment. It's in a great neighborhood in Lakewood, Ohio. And I tell you what, if you come here and you find yourself in the Cleveland area, make sure you make it over here to Molta Bene because as the name implies, it is very, very good. That'll do it for this edition of America Loves Food and Sports. I'm your man, Stephen Bardo. Until next time, peace.